People are just waking up to this latest political drama. One of China's most powerful figures and most powerful politicians has now been stripped of his top rankings. Also, his wife is now the prime suspect in um, the murder of a British national. This is very big news. A lot of people have been talking about it all night. Uh, what we've been hearing so far is that uh, Bo Xi Lai, of course, the man who is the uh, was the Communist Party chief of uh, the southwestern city of, of Chongqing, Ching and was a leading contender really to be among a handful of people to run the country after the leadership transition uh, later this year has now been suspended from his senior post uh, from his senior post within the Communist Party uh, the state media reported that last night that he has uh, suspected of serious violations of discipline the state media also reported that his wife as well as a family aide had been detained um, it linked possibly to the death of of Neil Haywood, who's a British national and a British uh, businessman, also a very close family friend of the Bows. Now, uh, people have also been talking about how this is going to be uh, really just the latest twist and, and uh, uh, very uh, concerning because uh, Neil Haywood had uh, died last November under very suspicious circumstances. At the time, investigators had said that uh, this possibly could have been brought on by excessive drinking. However, uh, now this case has has been ruled a homicide and has been turned over to, judi to judicial authorities. Manisha? Uh, meanwhile, it, so far as this actual announcement of what had happened to Bo Shilai went down, um, how was it executed uh, overnight? Well, it was really interesting because um, it was really a very well-coordinated uh, announcement. We saw it on state TV as well as online, and it's really a tantamount to an official government announcement. Uh, people here have been saying that this really uh, underscores that Bo's political career is over. Uh, Bo, um, as uh, many people here know and many people outside know, has been uh, is a populist. He's a very charismatic figure. Uh, he was really known here to encourage a, a very heavy, handed state and to fight corruption but his uh, reputation as a maverick uh, really rubbed uh, several people the wrong way and so people say that his sacking uh, was really seen as a, a, a way to, to highlight the rift uh, within the Communist Party and within the leadership and uh, now uh, what people are saying is that uh, this uh, latest announcement is is really an attempt for the leadership to try to put the scandal behind them restore some stability ahead of the transition of leadership later this this year.